It's the regional record extending 600th episode of the King of the Road Show HD on Fox 4, KBTV, and the CW. And we are celebrating this magnificent milestone with the TG and Tunes episode of the King of the Road Show HD. Southeast, Southeast Texas, Texas style. style. During the half hour, it will gaze in the rear view at the legendary T.G. Shepard's recent concert at Honky Tonk, Texas in Silsby. We'll feature the Evadale Raceway fabulous flashback. We'll also wear the Southeast Texas debut of Smith & Wesley's new video as our King's Country Music Clip of the Week. And Corey Michael will be in the, in Royal, the Royal Spotlight. Spotlight. Sponsored by Bradley's Collision Center in Fort Natchez. King of the Road. Howdy and welcome to this record-setting episode of the King of the Road Show HD on Fox 4, KBTV, and the CW. I'm Jim King of the Road. With this program, we're extending our regional record for a local independently produced entertainment-based show. Man, how time flies when you're having a royal time. Speaking of royal times, listen to the magnificent country music mix of Free 105.3. And catch the all-new King of the Road radio show, middays, Monday through Friday, following the fabulous Walton and Johnson Morning Show. And be sure to download the free app at freefm.net. Don't miss Travis Tritt live at Jefferson Theater on Friday, February 23rd at 8 p.m. Tickets available now at discoverbeaumont.com, the Beaumont Civic Center box office, and Ticketmaster. Register now to win free tickets on the contest page of jimkingoftheroad.com. Now ride shotgun with me to Honky Tonk, Texas, and Silsby. We always cruise Cadillac style, as seen on the Food Network. Extra large and turbocharged. It's the King of the Road Show. Oh, hi. One man has the power to take you behind the scenes. Jim King of the Road. Jim King of the Road. Country music, the songs that make the big bucks are the story songs. A few years ago, I asked a couple of songwriting buddies of mine, I said, guys, you've been writing all them great story songs for Kenny Rogers. Why the hell don't you write one for me? Well, a couple hours later, they called me and said, Shep, we have written you a career song. Now, I'm going to ask for a little bit of audience participation on this one. I'll tell you right where to come in. It was the holiday day of August. All of us were down by the banks of the Bay Rock River. I was next in line to be baptized at the innocent age of 10. I'll never forget, I remember it yet. The things that I clean few water. And the beaches were still filled. My this is your part. Do you want to go to heaven? Here we go. Shepard, great to Jim. finally meet you in person. <laughs> How you doing? Actually, I think I did meet you a few years ago yes, at, did. at the old um, uh, Wild Bills in Beaumont. Yes, yes you did. That yes. was in the mid 2000s. Yeah, I that that place burned, didn't it? Or, or something happened to it? Or they tore it down. Okay, you tore it down. Yeah, okay. that used to be the old Cutters where uh, right. Tracy Bird and Mark Chestnut played a oh, lot. Yeah. You probably played there too. I sure did. Yeah, but now yeah. you're at Honky Tonk Texas here. Yeah, and you know, um, coming here today is kind of special because. 
A lot of people feel that when you do like the big dates, like the eight, nine, 10, 12,000 people dates, that those are the big ones. Now, uh, these are the, are the big ones to us because you're uh, able to look right into the eyes of the people standing there on the floor and it's just it's like a closeness that uh, I, I enjoy these type of dates more than the, the huge dates. And Southeast Texas has great country audience here. <laughs> they really get into it. Well, you know, they like to sing along with you. Yeah. And, and that's great. You know, years ago when we first started out in the 70s and then all through the 80s when we had our hot years, 80s and 90s, uh, people didn't sing along with you. But nowadays it's kind of the thing to ask people to sing along with you because they all know the words. Hey, you said a lot of the younger people know it now, too. Yeah, we, we did a show last night, Ronnie Mills something I did in Houston, and, and I looked out and saw people in their early 20s that knew the words to every song. So that's that kind of makes an artist feel good when they walk out on stage and, and experience that. Your music's definitely timeless and uh, very recognizable with 21 number one hits, 14 consecutive number one hits in the 70s and 80s. Well, you know, I, I have been very blessed in my life to uh, be able to do what I love so much, make music. I was even more blessed to put together a string of songs that has, you know, stood the test of time and yeah. still enables us to go out here and work every week. And But, you know, that 14-song run was kind of an uh, unusual thing to happen at that time. But we everything we recorded went number one there for like two or three years. will air the Southeast Texas debut of Smith & Wesley's new video as our King's Country Music Clip of the Week. We'll also feature the Evendale Raceway Fabulous Flashback. And Corey Michael will be in the, in Royal, the Royal Spotlight. Spotlight. Sponsored by Bradley's Collision Center in Port Natchez. Next, we'll continue our gaze in the rear view at the legendary T.G. Shepard's recent concert at Honky Tonk, Texas in Silsby. Man, how time flies when you're having a royal time. It's the record 600th episode of the King of the Road Show HD.